What's up everybody, welcome back to Last Day on Earth Survival on the free to play account. So many of you have been, have been requesting this and here I am at the police station. I've stocked up on guns and on armour and meds and I'm just going to see how high I can get. So let's give this a go. I'm doing it with all weapons, save a little bit of armour. Unfortunately I haven't got any modifications completed on this account. Although, ooh, I am a bit of a pleb though because, think about it, I have now completed the gunsmith bench, and because of just me being a, yeah, storing absolutely everything up, I probably could have modded some of the weapons a bit, although to be fair I haven't actually really found many mods. I think I've, I think I've got mainly melee weapon mods from the farm, yeah, because I've just been sneaking around the farm, collecting loot and everything from there. Right, let's just carry on going. So, right. Yeah, good. We are still on our first gun. I think as the later on we get through this, it gets to the point where one gun lasts two rounds from about level 10 onwards. There we go. So, yeah, I just want to... Ideally, I'd be happy with getting to, like, round 40 or 50. That'd be fun. Not sure how long I could be here for, because I do have work later today. I'm starting work at... I think starting work at 7 and I'm working till about 3 a.m. So that's fun, I'm gonna be getting home about four in the morning. Well, actually, mm, yeah, probably get home around four in the morning. So it's gonna be a long shift. Go, okay, just gunning absolutely everything down. Let's stock up, get some, I'm gonna save the fully modded things for later. But I have got some that have got the handmade silencers on them, just because I'm not raiding that much on this account. And I'm going to try and prioritise progressing, progressing in the game before raiding a bit. I know raiding is good because you can get a lot of steel from it, but I think I need to more focus on getting things at oak at the moment. Right. Haven't got through our first armour set yet. Beginning to... There we go. This gun's almost broken. See, now this is why automatic weapons are not the best for this because they just miss so much so you really want to just be focusing on mods that increase the stability of weapons there we go die die excuse me make it there ah that was a brawler ro brawler roaring brawler whatever it's called right, die so i'm guessing there are probably some more efficient ways to do this that involve, I don't know, sneaking or whatever. Actually, no, I doubt it. Yeah, I doubt there's any little areas you can glitch him into. There we go. Right, let's just keep grabbing out more guns. Let's get two this time, because that one's looking a bit low as well. Right, yay, we are up to round eight. Perfect. You're only doing five damage to them. That is... A really weak weapon. Stupid things of armor. There you go, 12 hits on them. Oof. Oh, I thought that was two of the exploding ones going off, but nah. Hold it, hold it, hold it. There we go. Okay, that was the other exploder. That's him roaring. So I did go through a stage where I didn't get any of them roaring here. That was nice, I liked that. Because it made doing it a lot easier. There we go. Oof, this is going quite nicely. Alright, let's grab a bite to eat. There we are. Armour situation. Half health. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. What I might do is... Nah, let's just carry on doing like this. I was thinking of time lapse to get for a bit, but... You know what? If I'm going to work my way through it, then you can all watch me. Right. So, I believe once the police station resets as well, I am going to be able to finally finish my radio tower because I just need two more high-tech components. So, by the time this video is out, I will have hopefully gotten that completed. I recycled a phone and got an electronic circuit, which is why I'm doing it now. I've already opened up the crates in here once, but I just didn't bother recording it and then realised that people have asked me to actually record 
And I just run all the police stations, seeing how high I can get. So I might as well burn through all my weapons and armor. Uh, stop missing! Right. So I'm actually interested to see how many ticket things I'm going to get from this. Because most of the time I've just been opening up, I think, like, two of the blue boxes. Stop missing your damn shots. Your target's right there. Right, gun-wise, need more. Okay, you know what, let's get... Let's get a couple Glocks. Next round. Right, so I'm gonna have to be careful here, because if that Glock in... Oh, armor getting low. Hopefully it can survive this round. Uh, I forgot I've got my slow Glock. This isn't my... Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. This isn't my elite shutter Glock. Right, I'm gonna have to be careful not to do what I did on stream. So basically, on stream, I meant to click start wave, but I accidentally clicked surrender. And, well, yeah, pretty obvious, it surrendered it. There we go. So yeah, Glocks. I don't like using Glocks here. Bit on the risky side. Right, let's take a drink. Uh, let's do round 12. Oh, I forgot to do that. That was way too close to comfort. Almost died there. Okay. So I might be switching over to SWAT. Nah. I should really use the military armor in these lower tiers before the enemies get a bit stronger. Ooh, that's eight health there. Right, I can actually barely see as well because my curtains are wide open. I'm going to need to shut them in a second. Go and... There we go. Right, I'm going to close my curtains so I can actually see. My desk is right below the window. There we go. That's a bit better. I can actually see what I'm going to be shooting at now. Right. Oh, what am I doing? Let's stock up our med kits. There we go. And... Let's stock up there. Perfect. For, I think we should be good for the next round. So now, if we're lucky, we'll have gotten some of the proper tickets already, not just the little ones. Yeah. Taking two damage instead of five per hit is a lot nicer. Might be worth actually wearing SWAT shoes so I can outrun them faster. What well, I know is, how have people been managing to use grenade launchers here? Because I'm sure I would end up just blowing myself up repeatedly if I had grenade launchers here. Right, one hungry chumper to go. Don't you heal yourself. That's cheating. Whew. Right then, let's just keep working. So... How do people actually have the patience to get all the way up to round 99? I can't see me having that patience. I mean, I'm gonna try it. But, ooh, what's the time? It is 10 to 5. I still need to eat. I'm gonna aim to eat in half an hour. So I've got, I'd say, maybe 10 minutes here. 10 minutes to try this. So I'm gonna see how high we can get in 10 minutes. It's not aiming for the highest level. It's just seeing how high I can get before I have to actually go. Right, let's get all these killed. Oh yeah, so since by the time this video comes out, I will have completed my radio tower. If anyone wants to join my clan, there's a link in the description, so come and join that. Good, let's do that. So yeah, and tag either myself or one of the moderators, and let me know you want to join the clan. You'll be given a clan member role, which gives you access to the clan chat. So currently, of course, we'll only be able to add 10 people in-game. However, once clan bases are added, we'll apparently be able to add more people to the clan. So we'll sort of set about adding in people from Discord once we can expand. But uh, oh yeah, I'm also doing like a giveaway type thing to pick who's going to get put in the um, top 8 or 9 slots at the moment. Come on. Die. Oh, 
so what is this is only what 15 isn't it yeah right let's see now I'm not sure how I'm gonna be able to how high I'm gonna be able to get because I'm actually starting to run out of guns already what have we used we've gone through almost half of our guns already hmm a little bit concerning so I thought yeah that would be enough to get a lot higher Try and get a bit of distance on them. There we go. Yeah, it's not worth it for four hits of 15 damage. I can do it like that. Yeah, just gradually let them get a little bit closer at a time. Oh, there's three, four zombies still alive. Okay. Stop missing. Oh, I need to be doing half mode. Try and get some better weapons like scars. Although, to be fair, the amount of weapons it costs, the police station is much better because you can get mods from it. So, at the moment, unless you need C4, there is absolutely no point in doing half mode in the game. Alright, let's do this. Got a full set of SWAT. There we are. Okay, didn't actually get through that one. Perfect. Round 17. So I feel like in a minute I'm going to accidentally mess up and die. Just have that horrible feeling. What I might do is just hoard all of the ticket things I get from them and see if they... But ah, no, there's no point waiting to see if they buff the loot because they also might nerf the loot. Hmm. I don't know. I have to wait and see what I'll do. So, okay, that was both of them going. Nice, nice. Go. Round 18. Get in there. Gradually get in there. I prefer if there weren't explosive zombies in each round. Because they they don't really add anything. They just kind of get in the way of it. So yeah, if anyone does know a, a, a good, efficient way for doing the police yard, feel free to let me know. Right, I'm expecting, but see, now how do I get them to start walking? So that'll make them a lot easier to kill if they just walk the whole time. Expecting by the time I'm done for this place to be pretty much full of X's on the map. Let's do that. There we go. Oh dear, right. No, they're running. Yep, yeah, they're running. Okay, that one broke already. That's fine, actually, it was red durability, wasn't it? But there goes an exploder. Oh, I wish the exploding ones damaged the other zombies. It's really disappointing that they don't. Even if it didn't do a lot of damage, just like 20 to them, that would be perfect. I haven't got a Glock on me. Uh, let's get him away from. Uh, you know what? Let's just do this. There we go. Right, so what I'm going to do is go Glock for main, AK for secondary. Uh, let's grab a bite to eat. There we go. Round number 20. So I think this is where it starts getting harder. Actually, no, I'm doing this one way around. I want the fast weapon to start out with. Try and thin the rave a bit. See, I think this might be a good method. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. No! I might use... Oh no, an electronic circuit will just reset me, won't it? Oh, I screwed up. Alright, let's go see what loot we're getting. Disappointed. Yeah. Alright, I'll meet you back in the yard in a minute. Alright, on my way back into the police station now. That was incredibly disappointing. But let's see what loot we're going to get. If we're lucky, we'll get one of the blue tickets at least. There we go, there's a single green. I think I've already got maybe two blue stored up at my base. Not at the base, over at the bunker. So we've got five of the green ones so far. For those that don't know, don't bother opening the green ones. Don't do it. It is a waste of time. Uh, 
I'm so disappointed. I spent ages bringing all the stuff over here. Mm. Come on, let's get one blue from one of these. Just one. Come on. Last hope. No. Ah, well. Well, we can trade them in and get a blue, I guess. But now I'm also going to have to cart all of this stuff back to base. Which is annoying. I'll take the med kits because they're the most valuable to me at the moment. And I've got swap boots on already. You know, I'll switch this out for fresh set. So when I forget to actually get it all back, it's not the end of the world. There we go. Right. Um, so yeah, that's annoying. Right over here, I think I've already got three of the blue boxes. There we go, yeah. So these is, these boxes are basically what I use to do that police station. Ooh. Oh, of course. It's a blueprint I've already got. <laughs> I've got very few blueprints. And that is one of them. Um, you know what? Let's do it. Let's trade in. There we go. We now got ten of them. Trade them in for one blue. Ta-da! We now have one of these blue captain cards. Awesome. Alright. So I think I'm going to end off the video there. So I can, you know, like, go to work. So thanks a lot, people. Hope you've enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Don't forget to join Discord. Bye.